Hey everyone, what's up? Well, today I'm going to make another update video on the Pure Gallus sack. So it's going to be day 76. There's a lot of spiderlings that emerged, so I'll be showing you them. As well, we have some good news and bad news. Well, as you saw, two of my teas in the feeding video that I just uploaded yesterday were the Teocra tea and the Nandu Colorado Velosis. Well, the Nandu molted perfectly well. Um, actually can't see the specimen because uh, she's hiding but it is a confirmed female because you can see the spermatheci right over there and I can't believe I'm actually touching the skin because I react very strongly to Nandu hairs unfortunately my Teocrity did not make it um, She's been in the same position for almost a day now, and she's not coming out of it. It's really strange because uh, Teocrity are very easy to take care of, and I guess that just just happened just out of pure coincidence. I had a lot of humidity in there. Maybe I don't know. It kind of sucks. But anyway, but the good news is that. The Montreal Expo is actually very soon. I didn't really notice it because usually the Expo is in May, but actually it's in March 25th. So I'm definitely going to go and bring the camera and buy a couple of stuff, uh, namely the 500 Superworms for $12.50, uh, the Cork Bark, as well as I'll probably replace the Teocrity and the Hapulpa species, Columbia, large, before I got to the imports. Okay, so it, as I promised, we're going to look at the sack. It's day 76. Well, there's a lot more babies than we saw yesterday. Uh, so let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 15, 16, 17, 18, yeah, this one unfortunately got stuck in its molt, surprisingly it's still moving though, yeah it's about 18, 20, this one's actually molting, look at that, very cute very lively too so all these oh you can see one here here's number 20 he's molting out all these babies the eggs with legs which is uh, ones like those those are going to develop into the first instar stage uh, the black dark ones that you see over here those are bad eggs so they're dying And they're going to develop to uh, nice size spiralings. So, I'd just like to share this update. And tomorrow, if I see any good news regarding the sack, I'll uh, definitely update it for you. Okay, so the next video, as I did promise you a couple of days ago, uh, the MythBuzzer video on the Fermentopus species. And I will definitely make it. 